Sri Lanka's most powerful news brand. Now, after the Kapra Betel scare late last year, the tea sector of our country is facing a yet another red flag. The Japanese authorities have expressed their concern that some of the Ceylon tea exports to Japan are not up to the required standards. The Daily Mirror reported today that the issue has arisen as a result of the presence of a chemical component in Sri Lankan tea exports to Japan. The paper quoting the minister says the chairman of the tea board is scheduled to travel to Japan at the end of the month to discuss the matter with the authorities. According to the paper, the minister says the chemical levels in tea have increased with the use of weedicides introduced as an alternative for glyphosate. When news first inquired the matter from Minister Navin Sanayaka, he refused to comment. During the recent visit of Japanese Foreign Minister Taro Kono to the country, Minister Navin Sanayaka had requested more time be granted to enable tea growers to adjust to the revised regulations introduced by Japanese authorities on very low residue levels in tea which were enforced last October. Meanwhile, tea production in the country has increased sharply last year by 14.5 million kilograms. Though the country produced 307.07 million kilograms of tea last year, a percentage increase of 4.96%, the exports have only increased by 0.07%. The export volume only increased by 0.2 million kilograms and stood at 288.9 million kilograms last year. Tea prices in the review period increased by 26.19 to a record 807.44 rupees per kilo of freight on board price.